U.S. Sailing actually does uh, a lot of the heavy lifting. They have a pretty nice template, so organizing it wasn't overly difficult. Um, and the Bristol Yacht Club uh, race committee team was really good about volunteering uh, and finding more volunteers. Bristol Yacht Club seems to be a real sailing club, yacht club. And overall, they did a, the race committee did a good job setting up the race course, a lot of very good communication and everybody stayed close. We had four races today in a north breeze turning right, going to northeast, uh, going to east. And it was challenging. It was puffy, shifty. Uh, it was all over the place. You could look like a million bucks and then uh, you could be in the poorhouse the next second. Got cold a little bit one time. No, us Florida boys, are, our blood isn't quite as thick yet, so, but it's all good now. There's sort of some basic dimensions. I think the, the entire class rule fits on one page and the font is not very small. There's a lot of room for creativity, a lot of room for design, a lot of room for interpretation. You can really build a boat that's good for you, whether it's the displacement of the hulls uh, or the size and shape and angles of the dagger boards uh, or the bendiness of the mast and the flatness of your sail. There's, there's really a lot of um, variables that you can really tune for yourself. So that's one of the reasons you probably see big differences uh, in uh, performance out there is some people have boats that they've really done uh, a good job of matching to themselves and put a lot of work into it and uh, some of the rest of us are still working on it. <laughs>